This is Adrani. We set up this fake yoga class in order to help her find out if her boyfriend was using her for her money. We'll just call her boyfriend Nate. I'm just driving us everywhere. I'm paying his bills. I'm paying for his gas money. It's just everything. Clothes, all that. His clothes. <laughs> Like I say, man, like I said in, my, in one of my other videos, bro, if this is you, if you're this type of guy to where your your girl is is taking care of you, basically, you need to get off of YouTube after you watch this video and, and get on your purpose and, and put some grind in, bro. What you doing? You watching YouTube videos right now and somebody else got to gotta pay for you. Let's be real. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> why? Why? Well, I mean, I feel bad. We're together, you know, so I, I feel like... But you gotta smack him and, like, tell him, like, go get a job. Yeah, like, I've tried, you know, I've tried, <laughs> but it's, it's just not working, so, I mean... It's almost like it's in my character to help him as a girlfriend, but I feel like there's just more to it, and I don't know what exactly, so. But like, so what makes you distrust him? Because obviously. He's also like pulling away, like, it's like, I'm doing all this stuff for him, but he's not giving me the same energy back. Now what makes this even more sad and crazy is the fact that Adrani is young and by no means rich. She's living paycheck to paycheck herself and basically helping raise this grown ass dude. But to find out if Nate was using Adrani for her money, that was that was a that was kind of personal information. You not to say that, but okay. We're gonna have our friend Ashley test his loyalty. Will Nate be willing to cheat with Ashley, or will he remain loyal to a drawing? Oh, he cheated right there. They didn't already didn't show. <laughs> Damn, bro, come on now. I'm giving you permission. Go all in, whatever. Hey, comment down below. Is a massage from somebody that's not your significant other? Is that cheating? Comment, comment below. You have to do. I just want to see his character at this point. So. Yeah. <laughs> is Adrani being used for her money? I hope you guys are ready for this one, and I hope you guys have your talkies because you guys already know this shit's gonna be good. Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> I felt the cramp in my back. So to pull this test off, we first had to get Nate to our yoga class, which was easy thanks to Adrani. Adrani convinced Nate that her supposed friend Ashley invited them to come to one of the yoga classes that she was teaching. That comes from the <laughs> Minaj. <laughs> been there. Bruh. <laughs> we have tons of phases in this test and one has to be hit immediately after the other. Everyone knows exactly what they're doing, but we can't mess up because one mistake could cost us everything. Hello? Yeah, you remember how to get up here? It's just at the end of the turf. Okay, I'll see you soon. Hey Ken, if that was a drawing on the phone, don't forget to just your walkie off, okay? This is it, let's get ready, over. Thanks for coming. Of course, I had to come out and support. Thank you. My friend Nate. With Nate now here though, things are about to get good. This is just one of our first classes. So it's a small class. We have my videographer here, Elias, because we're just getting some promo footage. Um, Cause hopefully soon this whole row will be packed of couples. So we got Nate under the impression that Ashley wanted to film this class in order to grow her online yoga presence and get more people here. But that's not the real reason our cameraman Elias was there. The real reason was far more devious. Inhale. You see, Elias is a domino that will trigger all the other dominoes in this test to fall. Allow me to elaborate. <clears throat> the class will begin with everyone doing single yoga stretches. And when the time is right, Elias will exit the scene, which will then cue the yoga instructors to move on to doing couple yoga stretches. This will cue Anthony to supposedly get a cramp. And yes, I know it's supposedly, not supposedly, but I'm still gonna say supposedly. Get it, got it, good. How are your acting skills with pretending to get a cramp? Oh, I don't have to pretend, I'll get one. So. <laughs> we'll be good. The thing is that we have to time it perfectly. Because if I get one too early, I might screw it up. <laughs> Anthony supposedly getting a cramp will then cue Angel to ask for some Icy Hot. And since Adrani is a dancer, this will cue her to supposedly grab the Icy Hot from her car, which will then cue me to go grab Adrani from downstairs and bring it to our command center, which will then cue Angel to ask for some water, which will then cue Ashley so to ask me to help her get some get some water from the stairs, stairs. giving her the opportunity to finally make her, her move. See what I'm saying though? Like the videos really be thought out, bro. I don't I don't really think this is fake. If you think this is fake, comment down below and tell me why you think it's fake. Look, I know it's a lot, but the point is it all starts with this man. He is the key to everything. We're just gonna get our shoulders mobile. So we're gonna just do some tough rotations here. Everything's looking really good. The setup is not complete. We're gonna give it some time though before we initiate phase number one. 
The yoga class continued as planned, with everyone doing single yoga stretches. To make things realistic, we wanted to give it a good 45 minutes to an hour before having Elias make his exit, but it was getting really, really windy, and we were afraid that the wind would throw things off, so we decided to call it off after only half an hour. Elias, you're up. Let's execute phase number one. Get the heck out of there. Over. And so as planned, Elias made his exit, without saying a single thing. What the heck? Elias just freaking left. He didn't say anything. He was supposed to say, yo, I'm gonna go check out the footage, but he just left. I mean, it worked though. Nobody noticed. Everybody's just too busy fixing their mats. After realizing that Elias was no longer there, the instructors eventually moved on to the couple yoga stretches. Take the opposite hand and the opposite foot mm -hmm. and turn around and warrior. Really resist against your partner, really pull. The couple yoga stretches begin, and soon enough after a couple of them, Anthony's cramps kicks in. Ah, ah. Oh my god! What? What? Oh my god! Ah, cramp, cramp! Okay. okay, I'm not gonna lie, that was a terrible flop. The good thing is though, the good thing is that Nate had his back turned, so he didn't see that horrible performance. Stretch me! Stretch me! Stretch me! Stretch me! Does anybody have like Bengay? Does like Tiger Bomb? Do you have some cream? I think I actually have. I might have Tiger Bomb in my car, but I need to check. Okay, yes, check quickly. Yeah, check. Okay, she's gonna check if she has cream for you. I'm. So, I'm I don't. I don't ever remember using Icy Hot to help with cramps. Am I tripping? You know what I'm saying? Usually, you know what I'm saying, you just drink like pickle juice or mustard or something. Actually, I know not for cramps. That's usually for like soreness. I, I might be tripping though. I don't think I'm tripping though. For you. Anthony's Oscar worthy performance allows Adrani to make a clean exit, which in turn cues us to set up some cameras and then go meet up with her. I need mustard. Oh. See, see what I'm saying? Okay, I'm, I'm not tripping. Oh, I need mustard. I don't carry mustard with me, babe. Ah. You need to start drinking water. We eventually met up with Adrani, set up our home base, and established Starlight Feet. Those are your headphones. You don't have to wear those, though, okay. until they enter the apartment, which is not going to be for like another maybe like 10 minutes. How are you going to get into the Did apartment? Did you enjoy what we started of the class? It was interesting. I liked it. You liked it? Oh, well, you should definitely come back. You guys are good teachers. You oh. Made it pretty cool. Thank you so much. Oh, time for this phone call. <gasps> She's calling me. She's calling. She's calling. Hey, did you find it? I actually couldn't find any Tiger Bomb in my glove compartment, so I think I'm gonna have to go up to Walmart and buy some. That'd be great. He's still in a lot of pain. Could you please? Okay, I'll see you soon then. Okay, okay, I'll see you soon. Well, how long is they gonna fake this out? Soon. Thank you. Bye. So as I'm sure you might have guessed, Adrani's not really going to Walmart. We just wanted to buy Ashley 10 to 15 minutes to make her move. Adrani's gonna go to the store really quick. Yeah, I'm good, I'm she's good. gonna go and run to Walmart really quick. She doesn't have her car, but she's just gonna be like 10, 15. That's so sweet of her. I know. Is she sure? Yeah, yeah, she already had that way. How sweet of her to go and get that though. Do you by any chance have extra water? I have two cases in my apartment. Uh, I can just get it quick, but they're kind of heavy. Yeah, if you don't mind, because he really, like, I don't know. I'm just trying to help him out. He wants water. Yeah, of course. Uh, do you mind grabbing a case with me? I can't bring it all the way down by myself. I'm sorry. Is that okay? Yeah, yeah. Okay. You sure? Okay, we'll be quick. We'll be quick. Adrani's call cued Angel to ask for water, which in turn cued Ashley to offer the water upstairs. So off Ashley went with Nate, purposefully taking the long way up in order to give her team enough time to vacate the premises. Are you prepared for the possibility that he's gonna fail the test? Honestly, I think he could go like either way. Okay. I, I mean, I wouldn't be shocked. I just don't wanna think. Yeah. I wanna think positive, so we'll see. Yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I feel bad for testing him if he does pass this test, but my intuition is really good. I trust my intuition. I just want answers. But will you still keep paying for everything? <laughs> no, I'm gonna I'm gonna say like obviously there's a problem with it. Like I did all this. Yeah. This should be like the you should know by now that yeah. like, you are honestly. a certified sugar mama. Certified <laughs> <laughs> sugar mama. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I think this is them. Is this them? It's them. Oh. Just these two here. You ready? Yeah. I've had this knot since before class, and I thought stretching would make it better, but it's still so messed up. Bro, he really finna fall for this, bro. Cause they already show in the preview. Let me let me shut up. Let me shut up. Let's just watch. Let's just watch. Could you just please help me get this knot? It's really, really bad. <laughs> Oh, it's kind of dying, that's safe. Just quick, right. quick, quick, please, please. It's so bad. It's really bad. Oh, God. What is it? It's right by my shoulder blade, like right here. Where? Actually, could you just 
sit right here, you really need to get into it. It's really bad. And so after a flawless execution, we were now in the last and final phase of our plan. You have magic hands. Oh my God. Oh. Good job, Delta Squad. Nice job. Just Keep ignore that thing on my back, by the way. It's a mic. I thought we were gonna have a lot more couples in class today, honestly. So I was gonna use it. Our final phase began with Ashley explaining away her mic pack. It's in plain sight, but it's actually not even on. It was connected to Elias's camera, but being that he's no longer nearby, we're capturing audio from mics that we placed in the couch. We don't want Nate thinking the mic pack is recording though. The dream is to get the entire lawn filled, but I guess one day. I mean, in time, you'll definitely get a lot more couples. You can hear good and everything, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Babe, would you get mad if I was massaging another girl? You would walk away with no hands. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> okay, let me check. Wow, that's so nice. You are magic. <laughs> wow. Honestly, you deserve a massage. Mm -hmm. Turn around. I'm, I'm pretty good Shit, with myself. Right. <laughs> yeah. No. Uh, it's over with. You're Shit, little... you ain't lying. It's over no, with. No, tense yourself. It's because she's so tense. You're stressed. Anthony, if you were in this situation by yourself with another girl giving you a massage, what would you do? Bro, I wouldn't be in a room by myself what with I'm another saying, girl. Like, <laughs> oh, oh, like, what I'm saying, like, how you even, how you even get put in that situation, bro? Like, why is you sitting on the couch next to the girl, bro, massaging her? Now, now you know you, you, you thinking in the back of your head, my girl walking in right now. So you gonna trip out? So if that running through your head, why is you, why you participating, man? You tripping? Do you mind if I ask you kind of a personal question? No. What's up? See, that's the that's the that's the that's always the segue. <laughs> that's all y'all know what I'm talking about. That's always the segue. Can I ask you a personal question? <laughs> okay, I haven't known. Right then, when she said that, bro, she he should have just got up out of there, bro. A drowny that long. We just take some dance classes together. Uh, and I told her she could bring a friend to class, and she said, Oh, I'm gonna bring my boyfriend. I didn't even know she had a boyfriend. Have you guys been together for a long time? Yeah, we've been together for a little bit. Just a little bit? Yeah. Is it still kind of just cash or what? Why are you asking? <laughs> I don't know. I just thought that you were cute from when you came in. Thanks. Yeah. This is it. If you're not busy later, maybe we can get to know each other more. You could come here or something. You're bullshitting. No, I'm being serious. Would you want to hang out? <laughs> what, do you mean, what do you mean by that? I don't know, we can just like chill or something, drink some wine. I don't know, I just want to get to know you. What do you mean just chill? I don't know, whatever what happens, you happens, you know, but I just wanted to, you know, find out more about you, spend more quality time together, but I understand if um, that's not cool between your relationship. No, but, I mean, it's, it's fine. I mean, if you try and chill tonight, we can chill. Oh, shit. I'm, I'm not even surprised, though. He got that far. We knew that. We all knew that was with that. Why? I can't never talk, bro. Yeah? You don't have any plans at all? Nah, I got no plans. I can come over. You can chill. And do whatever we want? Whatever we want. I would really like to have you. I'm going to see. Well, you got to prove it first. What do you mean, prove it? Whoa! Look at that. See, I knew you were bullshitting. You know, like, <laughs> we can just save that for tonight. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> see, he's a nose to settle now. He's a really nose to settle now. Like, come on, man. See, come here. Oh! Here's a little, little teaser for later. <laughs> Get space no. from Granny Sam. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I wasn't expecting that, bro. I was not expecting her to do that. That's crazy. Fine. There you go. Is that good enough? See, I'm not sold. You do. bullshit. Me. One more. One more? Yeah. Bottom of lips. I'm gonna say, that looked like that was you. on the That's for tonight. I mean, the bedroom right there. You can go right out. <laughs> you gotta save a little something for later, don't you think? I mean, I still barely know you. Can't I just get to know right, you a little right, bit more? Right. So, shit, tell me about yourself then. He's trying to get to know him right now. 
Yeah. I see. Um, <laughs> yeah. It's like he didn't. He didn't forgot all about like, oh my girl, supposed to be coming. First of all, he forgot all about the dude downstairs. Second of all, bro, your girl is only going to the store and coming right back. You didn't got way too comfortable. Third of all, why is you? Why are you doing this, bro? You, <laughs> this is so obvious. It's kind of hot. Thank you. <laughs> his, his hands on her thigh. His caress. And then her. His girlfriend, why is she still watching this, bro? It's, it's over with. He failed already. It's over with. Me, if, if that was me, me personally, me, me, me personally, I wouldn't let that happen to me. You know what I'm saying? Seeing her thigh. Yeah, that, that body language is, is serious. He's not just saying that. Like, what are, what are we still trying to figure out here? What, what, what are we doing? Come on. Come on, fam. He's interested in her. He, like, he wants, he wants to get down, like, right now. Yeah. Why are you still watching say. So really, you're being serious, you and Adrani, or what do you you're mean? nothing serious? What do you mean you don't know what to say? Let's go up here and confront him. Come on, <laughs> let's go get some content, man. What you, what you doing? So, right? Stop, what you happened? and Adrani, you're, you're nothing serious, so oh. right? Stop playing, you know who I'm talking about. I'm serious, you guys like, aren't really like that then? Fuck no. No, oh. Okay. We ain't shit. I promise you. She ain't shit. Wow. Well, well then, I guess it's fine tonight then. What's up? Mm, eight o'clock. I'll be. If I'm being real. I wanted you the moment I saw you. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. I'm not gonna stop looking at you doing the oh. yoga stretches. Doing the yoga? <laughs> yeah. You were looking at me during yoga. Fuck You're yeah. lying. Yeah, stop. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. Oh my god. Why is she talking like that, bro? That's like. Ah, that's getting on my nerves, bro. Really? Stop, bro. Ugh. Oh, gonna help it. <laughs> <laughs> bro, look at her, bro. Like she, bro. This is cringy. This is. It looks so fake, bro. Can't believe this. Then tonight. I mean, she can go in the bedroom right now. <laughs> <laughs> Later, I told you. This boy said right now, like your girl ain't going to the store and coming right back. Dudes get stupid, bro. Dude, dudes really get stupid when it's when it's a female in front of them, bro. Dudes do some stupid things, bro. You think we should go in now? Like, and then first off, bro, she said no. <laughs> so why why are we still trying to convince? For all my my fellas out there listening right now, bro, if you gotta con convince her, it's over with, bro. You you tripping? Now, now we getting into into those vibes. You don't want to get into into those vibes. You want to get, you know what I'm saying? Like, look, she kind of looks uncomfortable. He's like being really aggressive. He's being too much. I, I agree. Yeah, with that. yeah, yeah. See, I know what I'm saying. Like, now you, you know, what I'm saying you doing too much, bro. He's kind of being a little too pushy. I think okay. she's in character, but look at her body language. Like, she's yeah. uncomfortable with it. Cool. He's leaning yeah, in no, more. Let's, let's look call at it that. Off. I do want to give you the option to either go upstairs and confront him and talk to him about this, or if you just like don't want to even go up there at all. I hate to rush you on um, making a decision or not, but yeah, we're gonna call this off. Um, no, I've seen enough. I've seen enough. Okay, so you want to go upstairs? Then see yeah, the move. I'm just gonna go up there. And so with that, our test officially comes to an end. Adrani decides to head upstairs to save Ashley from a very thirsty Nate. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be good to go tonight. <laughs> tonight, tomorrow night, any night. Oh, okay. Well. <laughs> if you don't want to go upstairs, you know, we don't have to go upstairs yet. No, so um, we can go upstairs. Yeah. I'm just honestly, I'm just ridiculous. When we first got together, he was just fine. I feel like we were both putting 50-50 in. Now it's just he's basically using me. It feels like he's using me, basically. Why not just... Cut it off, cut him off. Yeah, like. people have told me that. It's it's just, it's it's hard. Emotions are involved. Right. I just feel like I need to know what his true intention is with yeah. this. Adrani got the answer she was looking for and is now ready to confront Nate. Do you guys like, aren't really like that then? Fuck no. Oh. We ain't shit, I promise you, she ain't shit. I hope you guys have your talkies for this one because you guys already know. This, this shit's gonna be good. <sighs> what the? Are you fucking serious? We were only together for a while? For a little fucking while? Really? What is this? What the hell is wrong with you? What are you doing? What the fuck is all this? What do you mean what the fuck is all this? Does it matter? Yes, what the fuck is all this? It doesn't matter. You're cheating on me with another girl. I mean, I saw you put your hands on her. I saw the whole thing. So it's a fucking setup. Yeah, dummy. It is what it is, shit. That's uh, all you have to say? Yeah. Look, I don't give a fuck. You're a fucking know. liar. By the time we finally fucking caught on, we had to hire a whole fucking... <laughs>
Hey, bro. At that point, bro, you just got to leave, bro. When you in that type of situation, bro, just walk out. Like, you know what I'm saying? He would really like you. You have nothing to offer. No, shut the fuck up. No one's talking to you. I don't give a. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> hey, that boy's snapping in there. If you don't, why you still sitting there, bro? You think he would really like you? You have nothing to offer. No, shut the fuck up. No one's talking to you. I don't give a fuck. I really don't. You have no shame? You have no, no shame for yourself? Fuck no. For me, I'm chill. I'm good. You were just asking me for $20 yesterday. You're and not you chilling. Gave it, and you gave it to me. Oh. Thank you. Wow. So that's all you. Don't See? you think wow. you should be a little more respectful? Who the fuck are you? Like, <laughs> Hey. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny, bro. That was that was funny. This, this guy's funny. He's funny. This guy's hilarious, bro. That's all you. Don't See? you think you should be a wow. little more respectful? Who the fuck are you? Like, wow. just be respectful to her. I'm not fucking talking to you. You figured really? it out, right? Like, you know exactly Yeah, no, what's no going shit. On. Yeah, no shit. Like, you know she, that you're she had a higher whole ass too. Yeah. Are you proud of yourself? I hope you're proud of yourself. Low key, yeah. Because you're going to be broke after this. <laughs> I mean, shit, it's about time you finally fucking caught on. She ain't the first. Oh, he Wait, going crazy. He going fed. That's not even respectable, bro. Like, come on, man. Like, if you even if you get caught up like that, bro, come on, man. Like, just take your air. You ain't, you ain't got a dog kind of out, bro. That girl ain't do nothing to you, bro. That's not cool, bro. That's necessary. Like, why do you have to treat her like that? I'm just being honest now. You want you want to you want me to be honest? I'm being honest. I don't give a fuck. I really don't. So you're admitting but, that you're like Shut the fuck up. Her. I'm not talking to you. Shut the fuck up. You're fucking pathetic. This is is this a joke to you? This is how you act and you don't even care to explain yourself? Just leave yes, him alone. Because I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about you. You bought me all that shit. You spent all your money on me. That's so awesome. that's on your dumb ass. If that's all you're gonna say to her, then you can honestly bounce. I said this point has to go. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he got a high some security. He got a high some security. I ain't never thought about that. He never had security in in this is this is definitely uh, a situation for security. No one's here to do that. No one's here to do that. No one's here to do that, dog. But if that's all you're gonna say to her and that's how you're gonna treat her, you can take off, dude. Yeah, you really Like the fact that you can't even apologize, like you really are just. I don't give a fuck about her. I don't. And you don't think that's fucked up? I don't give a fuck. Fuck her. And fuck you too, bitch. Yeah, bye. Fuck you. You know, walking the shoes that uh she bought you onto the bus. You heard me get the fuck out. Why you gotta? Why she had to do that? Why, why she had to antagonize this man, bro? Why you had to provoke him? She just had to say something. Not, not, a, not, a, not the two dudes got to deal with what she just said to him. Come on, man. Be quiet. Get the fuck out. What's that shit again? All right, let's go. Hey. Let's get your broke ass out of here already. Shut up. I was about to go commit man on his ass. <laughs> wow. Hey. Subscribe, man. Watch these videos, bro. That's crazy.